In roughly seven weeks, if you can believe it, wow. Jamie, skiers <laughs> and snowboarders will be hitting the slopes for a New Hampshire for a new season in New Hampshire. And they will be greeted with some major upgrades at resorts all over the state. So Jessica Keeler, president of Ski New Hampshire, joining us live. And Jessica, it'll be here before we know it. Tell us about some of the exciting things people can expect to see on the slopes this year. Yeah, thanks for having me. Lots going on at New Hampshire ski areas this uh, this winter. Well, a lot of work being done over the summer and the fall. Um, we've got major resort expansions like um, South Peak, the South Peak expansion at Loon Mountain, where they have 11 new trails, a new quad lift, 30 acres of new terrain that will cater to beginners and intermediate level skiers. Uh, very exciting. Um, Cranmore Mountain is completing their new Fairbank Lodge, which is a 30,000 square foot building with a food pavilion, retail shops, a bar, condos. Um, and that's all part of an ongoing series of major upgrades that they've been doing at the, at the ski area that includes other lodges and buildings and hotels that have been built as part of their master plan. Um, and then there's other lifts being replaced too, such as the Mountaineer, uh, the new quad at Atatash <clears throat> Mountain Resort, which is uh, a long awaited lift that is replacing the Summit Triple. Um, there's, there's other work going on at places like Gunstock. There's gonna be a new rental building and tuning shop. King Pine is also getting a new uh, rental shop or an expansion of their rental shop. And then um, they're gonna have this new rooftop deck off the main base lodge there. Um, Waterville Valley, also a brand new deck off their freestyle uh, lounge, which will, you know, these are just like fun things for skiers when they go there. Um, yeah, I, th I think we're going to have a great winter and, and skiers are going to be really delighted with some of the changes and the new additions to the ski areas around the state. Expansions across the state. Yeah. Uh, but, you know, last year we had a very mild winter and that impacted ski resorts across the state. Some even had to delay their opening. So will there be any snowmaking capability upgrades and uh, will those upgrades be able to help resorts stay on track and open up on schedule and maybe even stay open longer? Yeah, ski areas are always investing in snowmaking. It's one of the most important things that we can do. Um, it's it's a major part of our efforts to be sustainable, um, both environmentally and just as a business. So you know we're we're constantly seeing upgrades to snowmaking, more efficient um, equipment that's being installed, and it really helps us to take advantage of those windows of opportunity when the weather is just right. So yeah, I think I think skiers will. You know, I think they've gotten used to seeing that our ski areas are constantly investing in that and that despite what Mother Nature sometimes throws at us, you know, we, we can deliver a pretty good product. All right. Great news all around. We'll see you on that rooftop deck. OK, that sounds great. Awesome. Jessica Keeler, president of Ski New Hampshire. Thank you. Thank you.